In this video, I'm gonna show you how to upload a video as an Amazon influencer to your shop. This is on desktop. I also have a video on how to do it on mobile, so you can check that out in the description box below. So once you navigate to your shop on Amazon, you will go up to this little dropdown that says create content, click it, then go to post video and photo, click that. It will open up a new tab and then you can upload your video here and then I'll show you everything else you need to do, all of the steps you need to do to get your video on there and as a shoppable video. So first you'll click this little upload. So you will have your pop-up come up and then you'll select the video you want. I created the video already and I named it what the product was so I remembered and then I click on that and click open. It's going to start uploading the video and it will tell you how long it's taking here. And then the next thing you can do is either add a thumbnail, tag the product or create the title. You're gonna wanna do all of these. So let's start with tagging the product. When you click on that, it brings up your idea list, your orders and your browse history. If you recently were on the product page, which I was, I have it over here in another tab. This is the product I am doing. Then you'll find it here in your browse history and you can just click tag product. If you had it in your recent orders, it'll be here, or you'll have to go to browse history, type the entire product name, and then click search. Then you'll see all of the options that are kind of similar, and you'll select the one that you're actually reviewing and click tag product. When you're done, you click done. And if you have a short video, you can see in the time that I was tagging the product, it already uploaded, so that's great. Then we're gonna wanna create the title. So sometimes I will start with just posting the name of the product and kind of seeing what I'm working with. So we can see that that's obviously too long, so we're not gonna use all of that. So let's just delete the second half. And then sometimes I like to go back to the product and kind of scroll down and see what questions people were asking and what the other videos are showing. So this just has a customer review, so that's not really that helpful, but we can go down to the questions and there's a lot about sand sold separately. Does it come with sand? So maybe something with that. Let's go back here. Play construction sand kit, we're gonna just delete that name. Play construction sand kit. I'm gonna add review since I made a review here. And then comes, let's say comes with sand. Comes with magic sand and toys. So they usually recommend you say, go under 60 characters cause that's what's gonna show. Comes with sand and toys. Let's just do that for now. And then we can change the thumbnail if we don't like this one. If you're trying to save time, you can definitely just use whatever they've auto-generated, but I usually like to change it to something that is a little bit different. So I will sometimes just take a screenshot that I like better and change the thumbnail, or I will do something with an arrow or some text. It kind of depends on the product, honestly. With this, I'm just gonna do a screenshot that I liked better than the one they chose. It took me like, five seconds and I think that people will click that more. When you're done with the video, the thumbnail, the product being tagged and your title, you're ready to submit your post. So you click submit post and then it is ready. This has to go into the queue to be approved and most are approved and published within five hours. So you can go to your storefront and kind of see when that happens by going to manage content down to video, click on video. And then you will see up here what is processing. So you can see that this video is still processing. It's not even processed. So it's not even in the review section yet. When this changes, it will say in review. And then when it's done, it will say publish. So that's how you upload and have a video shown on Amazon in your storefront as an Amazon influencer. I hope this was helpful.